All right, grind gang, we about to fall up in here. I don't know what they talking about, but we about to fall up in here. Life for for Cleveland, hustle all evening. Haters try to block you on the route, take a scenic. Looking like cribs. Grind gang, what it do? It's your boy, Roll 100, and I'm back with another video. Hey, check this out. Yes, sir. We got Sam's Club. I gotta tell y'all something about sticking around those areas where the wholesale clubs. I hope everybody turned in their little whatever states qualify for delivering alcohol too. Because you can get more orders and the, the orders are a little bit more. So, you know what I'm saying? Open the door. Okay, I got an order for Sam's Club. I'm at Sam's Club already. Because this is where I wanted to get an order from. So I just really pulled right up at Sam's Club hoping to get an order. And uh, what do you know? So I'm going to accept this order. Try to find me a parking spot a little closer. And I'm accept this order. I like to wait to the last possible minute to accept my order or the last few seconds because, and I'm not suggesting that you do this because I don't, you know, if something happens where your phone doesn't respond or something and you missed the order, I don't want you to be upset at me because you missed the order. You know what I'm saying? I got 50 seconds to respond and uh, answer this order. I'm about to answer, but I'm already here at Sam's Club. And so it's 10 items. And I don't know water or nothing like that. So anyway, let's go in here and see what it do. Grab this order. I accept it. I got to drop this off like right at Public Square. If you know about downtown Cleveland, the Public Square is like the right in the middle. There's nowhere to park or nothing like that. But it says right here in the notes, they got a number for me to call when I'm on my way and they're just gonna come down and meet me. I'll just open the trunk and they'll grab everything. So that's cool. So yeah, let's go get it. All right, grind gang, we about to fall up in here. I don't know what they talking about, but we about to fall up in here. Go grab these 10 items, take this ride, drop it off. Get this quick $25. It's all about them Sam's Club, Costco, BJ's. Those orders get you that guap. Let's go in here. First of all, let's see what they want. All right. Let's see what's on this list. About to ask you this, my hands are grinding. All right, that. Oh, yeah, knock this drain out right quick. All right, grind gang, we leaving Sam's Club. Finna go do this job real quick. I wanted to bring to y'all five questions that I had from several members of the grind gang, different five different members of the grind gang. That DM me on Instagram and I want to address each one of those questions. Each week, I'm going to pick five new questions to address. So if you follow me on Instagram, make sure that you leave a comment not only here, but you leave a, a DM on Instagram. That way, I can answer you direct, you know what I mean? I try to get to all the comments. I usually do get to every comment if I can. Um, every once in a while, one might slip through the cracks. But if you DM me on the ground, I'll make sure I got your question and I can also refer back to 
what it is when I'm getting ready to record my video. I can refer back to the DM that you sent me and try to address some of the uh, concerns or questions that people might have. Um, just anything, not just doing it by Instacart, but uh, DoorDash, um, Lyft, any questions you guys got, man, just, just reach out to me. I know the grind gang ain't shy because people ask me some, some off the wall stuff, you know what I'm saying, like, that I wouldn't expect. I ain't talking about no X rated, I'm just talking about some stuff that I just wouldn't expect, you know, that I wasn't thinking about, so I appreciate, um, uh, jog on my mind like that and uh, get me to think about things from different perspectives and uh, I'm going to try to keep on letting me know how y'all grind, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to keep on letting y'all know how I grind. Alright y'all, I just dropped that order off. Man, I was about to be a little salty, man. I do not like going downtown, but right here, dropped it off at the casino. It's crazy where I used to work at. Actually, somebody that I knew pick it up something they came out met me right on the curb they brought somebody out with them i popped my trunk bam they grabbed it peace out you feel me so anyway on to the next one you already know what it is it's your boy roll 100 i'm out here all right grand gang i just pulled up at bj's for my second order at i don't know if y'all can see that and we at bj's for this next order we finna run in here and pick this up only it's only uh, four items, so I mean, this should just take me a couple of seconds. I know a lot of y'all complain about not having a lot of items, but you gotta understand that with this new system, it's not about how many really are items that you really have. To be honest, you want to get those wholesale club orders. So to get those batches from a wholesale club, if you work in those areas that that um, Instacart partners with wholesale clubs in your area, make sure you find like a zone that has more than one wholesale club in it. If you don't if you don't mind shopping at wholesale clubs i don't mind a lot of people do mind because they're afraid they may get some of those orders where it may, yeah, it may be a few things but it's a few cases of pop or it's a you know a few cases of water or something like real bulky or some heavy stuff you know what i mean just to really don't want to carry a whole bunch of stuff i can understand that but if you are looking to get wholesale club orders and I look to get wholesale club orders because you get paid the most off of those. You get tipped the most off of those. People appreciate those more. And usually when you're dropping wholesale orders off, sometimes to residents, but a lot of time you're dropping them off at like businesses and stuff like that. So they don't mind, you know, dropping a little extra tip because it's not even their money most of the time. So check this out. Um, the zone that I'm, that I'm working in right now, this is the zone I normally pick. There are three wholesale clubs in this zone. Costco, BJ's, and uh, Sam's Club. So all three of those, plus a host of Heinen's, several Aldi's, and I mean, it's a bunch of other stores to shop at as well in this area. So that's why I usually choose this zone. And today you saw earlier, I started off at Sam's Club because I knew that's where I wanted my first order at. As soon as I pulled up at Sam's Club, I immediately got an order. Once I drop that off, my next order is uh, BJ's. So I'm here at BJ's, finna knock out this BJ's order. And we gonna get on to the next. So this is what I do when it comes to creating my zone. I try to uh, base it on, you know, what stores are in that area. And, you know, cause it kinds to help. It, it makes a difference in what type of money I'm offered for the batches that I get. Anyway, it's your boy, Roll 100. We finna go in here, we gonna grab this and then we gonna keep it smashed. Now let the sunshine fool you, man. It's just bright outside, but it's still Cleveland weather, though. What I do like about BJ's, it's a little bit more organized in here than some of the wholesale clubs that we tend to shop at. It's almost 10 pounds, so, I mean, it is 10 pounds, pretty much, so, you know, that's something you might consider, but like I said, I'm picking up four things, so, chicken wings, sugar, some grillers, so, that's nothing. Let's grab it. You know, throughout the day, getting all these groceries, you get hungry looking at all of this stuff. Well, at least I do, because I'm a fat boy at heart. When they be giving out samples and stuff, I be at them. Trust me. Gotta have that. Man, was that a dog? I guess. 
I feel y'all on the dog situation. Tell me what y'all think about that. I'm just saying, like, if you was, if it's a C and R dog, I can dig that. But if it's, it's like the companionship. No, you're okay. I feel like you should leave your companion in the car. Okay, we gotta get some Purdue wings. Right here, 6.84. Make sure y'all put the right pounds in there. That that matter how much y'all get paid, by the way. I ain't saying overcharge people. I'm saying some stuff come already packaged and it's more than in the package than what it's supposed to be. So that's nothing you can do about pre-packaged stuff like that. So you just gotta try to get something as close to what they ask for as possible. Veggie burger. Believe that. No car needed. Bang. Headed to the checkout. All right, grind gang, we just picked up those four items from, uh, what is this, BJ's. And we get ready to drop them off. It looks like we got about six minutes. Alright grind gang, done and done. On to the next joint. I ain't gonna lie, I'm a little hungry. I just saw um I just saw a couple little food places up here. I really don't be trying to spend no money, but I got a coupon. coupon for a free french fry with mcdonald's so i think i'm gonna order me a french fry and a large sweet tea and keep it smashing i'll be on the route to the paper like a bus line money transactions move faster than the rapid transit slow money no money stagnant life for for cleveland hustler all evening haters try to block you on the route take a scenic looking like